Hello there, I am the doctor who's seeing you today. Yes, I've not long woken up, and yes, I'm still wearing my pyjamas. So, I uh, have the records here from our last checkup. I want to start by making a few uh, visual inspections. Previously, your BMI was 27 and looking at the accumulation of adipose tissue in the midsection, I'd assume that your BMI has probably increased from last time. Okay, let's have a little First, you need to take off your glasses. Let me have your bifocals, please. Okay, obviously, we are concerned with sight. Just looking at the bifocals. Unfortunately, the pads are in disgusting condition. Just have a little look at those. You've obviously not visited your opticians in a while glasses have not been serviced. You have uh, accumulation of crust and they're starting to go a little bit green due to the skin secretions reacting with the materials there. So you really need to get to the opticians there. Absolutely filthy. Okay, so we've done visual inspections. I'm just going to get the equipment out we're going to be using today. Very sophisticated equipment. Have a little look here. Okay, I have everything I need. We're checking you out. Okay. I've also got my sophisticated stethoscope here actually upgraded our equipment to this very sophisticated model here. What do you think of this? Okay, let's have a little listen. Okay, just breathe normally please. And in through the nose and out through the mouth. normally please and again take a deep breath in hold it and out deep breath in again hold it and out yeah, actually picking up a lot there the heart rate is a little bit high your blood pressure in a short while. Okay, let me take the equipment out of the case now. Okay, let me check your temperature now. We need to open the mouth, lift the tongue and we'll place it just underneath and lower the tongue. Close the mouth gently and just relax for a second or two and looking there I don't actually understand these numbers but we have a sad face that illustrates to me that things aren't so good there temperature not so good Okay, I want to have a little look inside your mouth now. 
I'm actually going to be scrutinising your teeth today. I have this scale here for grading the teeth. Okay, so if you could open wide for me, please. Premolar 11, posterior molar 11, and wisdom tooth at the back there. That's actually an 8, good, coming across here. And in size 10, 11, 10, and 11. Up and wide again, please. Nine there, seven, and eleven, eleven, twelve, and an eleven there. Okay, so just looking in the mouth, unfortunately, your teeth are in a state of discoloration there. Not too happy with that. Obviously, you need to cut down on the coffee. You need to be careful what you're drinking. All right. So glasses, pads, not very good. Heart rate a little bit high and teeth discolored. Shall we have a little look inside your ears with the expensive otoscope here? A little look at this new model. The surgery is recently acquired. Okay, let's have a little look inside this ear, please. Okay, so there's a lot of accumulation of wax, especially on the concha. Now the ear canal appears blocked. There's a lot of wax. Okay. Can't see the tympanic membrane, but too much wax in that ear. Okay. And for the other one, a bit closer now at the external parts and I don't think you've washed your ears in a few days okay and quite clearly an accumulation of wax too much wax surprised you can hear me with what's going on there inside your plug hole okay that's rather disgusting Okay, so you need to do something about that. You need to get your ears syringed. Okay, what are we going to do next? We're going to do some reflexes. We have the reflex hammer here. Okay, part of the exclusive new equipment that the surgery has acquired. So I just want the arms to go floppy at the sides there, please. Reflex is not too bad, so you've got one thing going for you there. Okay, let's move on to blood pressure now. Just roll up your left sleeve. 
Okay, here is our new device. We're checking your blood pressure. Going to pop this, the upper arm there. Give the device a little squeeze, and then I'll read off the scale. Okay, breathe normally, do not hold the breath. It appears that we have a problem with the monitor there. Okay, let's try again, please. Um, there we go. Okay, good. Are you ready? Okay, thank you. I'll write those numbers down. Okay, let's have a little look inside your eyes. Now, unfortunately, the ophthalmoscope is quite old and in a little bit state of decay. The light source isn't working, but I can see the external areas in a little bit of increased magnification. So just look straight ahead. Okay, just look up. Look right. Look left. Look down. I'm actually not going to lift the lid because the eye is looking rather yucky. I can see that there's redness. Look straight ahead and there's some sticky discharge on the lower margin there. Okay. Look at your other eye, just look straight off to the distance. Okay, now looking up, left, and to the right. Looking down. Okay, so your eyes are red and sticky. Okay, have you not noticed this? That's what I'm going to just make a note of that. And I'm going to instill some antibiotic drops on your eyes. Switch to a new brand here. There we go, we've switched to this brand here. Sorry about the sunlight. Okay, just looking up to the ceiling. I'm dropping this one and one drop in that one thank you while those are working i'm just going to review your medication in your tray here dryptoline sopralon paramate all of a statin and ramipril just do one of those two Friday. Okay, I'm going to prescribe some new medication for you. There we go. I want to take one of these a day, please. One of these tablets a day. I'm just going to pop them in your tray. Okay, and I'll see you again.